Hitting the gym is fun weights. Music. Socializing. But there are going to be times when you want to squeeze a workout in and don't have access to any equipment. Good news. Though lifting weights has a ton of benefits. Bodyweight exercises are still super effective for getting stronger and improving fitness. Here. The best bodyweight exercises that will become your go-to moves for developing strength all over your body which are demonstrated by various superb trainer. Try the best bodyweight exercises for an amazing workout at home, on vacation, or at your local park, or just keep this video on hand for when you need a little inspo. Without much I do, let's try these out. Day 1, Forearm Plank A lift both knees off the floor and straighten legs to come into a forearm plank position, squeezing glutes together and engaging core. Actively push away from the floor and maintain a straight line from head to heels. Hold for 45 seconds. Do three sets. Day two, high side plank. A lie on right side of body. Right elbow resting on the floor in line with right shoulder. Both legs extended out to left side and feet stacked. The engage core. Ground through right elbow and feet and lift hips and knees off the floor. Simultaneously raising left arm toward the ceiling. Gaze toward left hand and maintain a straight line from head to heels. Hold for 45 seconds. Switch sides. Repeat. Do three sets. Day three. High plank with knee to opposite elbow. A start in a tabletop position on the floor with hands stacked directly under shoulders. Knees bent and stacked directly under hips. And feet hip width apart. You lift both knees off the floor and straighten legs to come into a high plank position on palms. Squeezing glutes together and engaging core. Actively push away from the floor and maintain a straight line from head to heels. This is the starting position. See bring right knee up to meet left elbow. Hold for 3 seconds, then return right foot to the floor. D bring left knee up to meet right elbow. Hold for 3 seconds, then return left foot to the floor. Continue alternating for 60 seconds. Do 3 sets. Day 4. Forearm side plank. Hi there, I'm Brianna Bernard, and I am a certified personal trainer and an isopure athlete. Today, I'm going to show you how to do a mountain climber. Mountain climbers are known for their strength, endurance, and agility. So let's get Right elbow resting on the floor in line with right shoulder. Both legs extended out to left side and feet stacked. The engage core. Ground through right elbow and feet and lift hips and knees off the floor. 
simultaneously raising left arm toward the ceiling. Gaze toward left hand and maintain a straight line from head to heels. This is the starting position. See drive hips toward the ceiling, then dip right hip toward the floor. That's one rep. Continue for 60 seconds. Switch sides. Repeat. Day 5. Mountain Climbers Exercise Modifications Even though there are no kettlebells or fancy equipment involved, mountain climbers are a seriously tough exercise. And it's okay if you want to modify them to meet your fitness level and needs. In fact, modifications are a great way to ease any painful pressure on the wrists. Says Smith textbook proper form is with your hands right underneath your shoulders. But everyone's body is slightly different, depending on what you do on a daily basis. Your strengths or your injuries, she explains. Pain in the wrist. Sometimes pushing your hands out a little bit further forward can alleviate the stress. Day 6. Triceps dip to panther and plank variation to strengthen shoulders. Reverse plank. As sit with legs stretched out in front of body. Feet together and toes pointed toward the ceiling. Place hands on the floor behind butt. Fingers facing body and gaze forward. Be engaged core. Press hips up toward the ceiling, holding legs together. And send toes to the wall in front of body. Maintain a straight line from head to heels. A sit on the floor. Hands behind body with thumbs pointing forward and fingertips on a slight diagonal. Lift hips up. Shift weight into hands. Open chest and roll shoulders back. Be bend at elbows and send them straight back until butt taps the floor. See push into hands to straighten elbows. Do 5 reps. Day 7. Scissors and toe reaches. A lie flat on back and lift legs and hands up toward the ceiling. Be keeping core engaged. Lift shoulders off the floor and reach hands toward feet. Then lower shoulders back to floor. Repeat for 30 seconds. A lie on back. Hands under butt for support and legs extended straight on the floor. Lift right leg up to point toward the ceiling. Be while lowering right leg. Raise left leg to point to the ceiling. Repeat for 45 seconds. Alternating legs. Day 8. Modified hand release push up. A lie on stomach and bend knees so legs form a 90 degree angle. Place hands next to rib cage. Be keeping calves raised in the air and knees on floor. Push torso off the floor with elbows squeezing sides. Lower back to the floor. See lift hands and extend arms straight in front. Hovering off the floor. Bring arms back to sides and place hands next to rib cage. Continue for 25 seconds. Day 9. Squat jumps. A stand with feet hip width apart. Push hips back and bend knees to lower into a squat. Be push off the floor to explosively jump as high as possible. Land softly. And then immediately squat down to jump again. Do a MRAP for 1 minute. Day 10, cool down, warrior 2. A stand with feet wider than hip width apart. Turn right toes out and left toes slightly inward. Bend right knee and lower hips down. Make sure right knee is directly above ankle. Extend arms straight out from shoulders. and press the outside of the left foot into the mat. Continue to sink lower into hips as spine stays long. Day 11 Pretzel Side Kick A start seated with left knee bent directly in front of left hip and right knee bent behind right hip. B rotate torso and place hands on either side of left knee. C brace core and lift right knee and foot off the floor. Keeping chest lifted, D keep right leg lifted and extend to kick. Leg parallel to the floor. Bend right knee back in and release it to the floor. Try to do 3 sets of 15 to 20 reps per side. Day 12 Stationary Lunge A stand with feet together holding a dumbbell in each hand. Take a big step behind body with left leg. Lifting left heel off of the floor. Keeping most of the weight in right leg. Be slowly bend both knees. Lowering body straight down until both knees create 90 degree angles. Making sure to keep front knee in line with ankle. See push down through front heel to slowly stand back up. 
Try to do 3 sets of 15 reps per leg. A stand with feet hips width apart. Holding a dumbbell at either end with both hands in front of chest or a resistance band around thighs. Bend knees. Sit back into hips and lower body until thighs are almost parallel to the floor. Keeping back straight and knees behind toes. Behold this squat position and walk to the left. Stepping out with left foot and then walking right foot to meet it. Keep shoulders back and abs tight to avoid hunching forward. Try to do 3 sets of 15 steps in each direction. Day 13 Quadruped Hip Extension A start on hands and knees with knees directly below hips and wrists directly below shoulders. Fingers pointing forward. Be keeping core engaged to avoid arching back. Lift right leg to the sky. The foot should be flexed so sole of foot is facing the ceiling. Avoid rotating hips by keeping shoulders and hips squared to the floor during the entire exercise. Return to start to finish the rep. Then repeat, try to do 3 sets of 8 to 12 reps per leg. Day 14 Dumbbells and Triceps Kickback A hold dumbbells in each hand and maintain a soft bend in the knees. Then hinge forward at hips. Be bend elbows and bring weights up to chest. Then extend arms, bringing weights back behind hips. Maintain tight elbows. See squeeze at the top of the movement. Then return arms to starting position and repeat. Do 12 reps. Pick up. A stand with feet slightly wider than shoulder width apart. Hands in ready position in front of chest. Be in one swift motion. Squat down to sweep right hand along the floor to the left and up, as if picking something off the ground. See as right hand comes up to meet the left hand. Stand and hop to cross the left foot in front of the right. Be immediately hop feet apart to return to starting position. Then repeat on the other side. Sweep the left hand along the floor and hop the right foot in front. Repeat for one minute, unless you own a Peloton bike. Genuinely enjoy pounding the pavement in your neighborhood. Or have access to a friend's elliptical or treadmill. Cardio work can be tough to fit into a gym or studio free fitness routine. And that makes at home cardio workouts particularly easy to put on the back burner. Speed scatters. But begin standing on left foot, in one fluid motion. Leap to the right and shift body weight to right foot. Be while shifting body weight. Send hips back and reach left arm toward the floor and left leg back behind right. Continue alternating sides. Kettlebell or dumbbell swings. A stand with feet shoulders width apart and a kettlebell or single dumbbell on the floor about a foot in front of toes. Hinging at hips and keeping a neutral spine. Bend down and grab the kettlebell handle or one side of the dumbbell with both hands. Be to initiate the swing. Inhale and hike the weight back and up between legs. See powering through hips. Exhale and quickly stand up and swing the weight forward up to eye level. At the top of the movement, the core and glutes should visibly contract. De-drive the weight back down and up underneath body. Repeat. Thrusters. 